Alright, so in this video I just want to go through a couple of tips I've just um, I've picked up along the way when doing this project. So we're going to remove these IKs and replace them with set driven keys in the next few videos. So before I do that I just want to demonstrate something now. When we're duplicating this over guys, uh, we could firstly duplicate the mesh and to switch the hand around we just rotate the Y axis by 180 and inverse the X scale so put a minus sign here and as you can see now the glove the the strap glove is on the outside on both arms so they're facing the right way so that there are two arms but if we want to mirror the, the joints and stuff we can select the joints uh, go to skeleton and uh, mirror joints alright so we can mirror it in axis and stuff and we can search for a term used when naming these joints and replace it with something else uh, left and right um, that's the most common example guys uh, mirroring stuff left to right if you're doing a character and stuff and we can go to mirror but as you can see uh, we've got a bit of a problem because not all our IK handles have been picked up let's do it again mirror joint so that thing is a bit dodgy isn't it um, <laughs> don't worry we're going to re redo the fingers with the set driven keys but um, as you can see the IK handles for the fingers have not been mirrored only this this kind of frame up on it only the IK handle for the arms being mirrored I don't know why but that's a big problem for us because we'll need to redo all the IK handles and stuff so to deal with this guys um, well it's not a solid solution but to copy everything over you can select the for example the joints, the mesh and all the IKs so everything's selected and there's a special function called um, <laughs> duplicate special alright so duplicate special if we go to the uh, options we can duplicate everything as a parent in the world or like as a new group if you wanted to so number of copies and if you tick this box here duplicate input graph every single thing gets duplicated um, even the IK handles and stuff like that and uh, if we go to duplicate special boom everything's been duplicated and uh, we can just to prove my point we can smooth bind this and um, yeah everything's the same so that's that and uh, oh. alright um, and that's that guys the duplicate special is really good if you want to copy over like IKs and stuff like that but our problem here is that we've uh, both hands are in the same direction if we if we uh, group like use this group if I go to my hierarchy um, scroll through my objects this is the group we just created under the duplicate special so but the problem is all of our IK handles are grouped here if we remove them and stuff and things just get messed up because there's a relationship with the group and the IK handles but and we need the IKs in this group so we can flip it around and they stay in the right direction like all the IKs in the right direction um, so it's not a valid solution if we want to flip it around but if you just want to duplicate things it's a really good solution one more thing I forgot to mention uh, if you wanted to detach this I think it's detached now so just bind it uh, if you want to detach it like in this position for example and detach it guys uh, open up the box to prevent the, th the arm from going back reverting to its original position go to bake history and uh, detach it from there and now the arm will not go back to its uh, original position um, detached like that in the opposite situation uh, we can move it back to its original position like around or a random position if I can select the thing if we go to detach the default values delete history detach oops select the mesh detach and then it goes back to its original like before we uh, moved it so just a quick tip guys um, yeah my fingers a bit sticky and things mess up so I'm going to delete that now um, that's it for this video guys just a couple of tips in Maya in the next few videos we'll um, replace the finger eye case with the set driven keys alright so thanks for watching the video